Hey guys, T Bolov here, and uh, this popped up today, so I thought it was worth doing a video on uh, a black Edinburgh crate. You can see some of the things that are available in that crate, including the black Edinburgh, the 1.04% chance of getting the boat. Uh, I did a whole other video on this boat. You can go back and take a look at that if you're interested in seeing, but short version is that it is in Edinburgh a tier eight British light cruiser, pretty good boat in its own right, uh, that has been painted black. Um, they didn't change any of the skills. It's got a little bit larger health, health pool and it's got uh, like another 12 or 16 damage per hit on the guns. Uh, and that's it. Beyond that, it's an Edinburgh, painted black. And I got a whole video you can go take a look at if you're interested. Uh, the point of this video is because they did throw it in a crate and because I have uh, plenty of gold available on my press account from the good folks over at Wargaming, I thought I would do a real world test and see how many crates did I have to open to get the boat. Because I know that's what everybody is concerned about is, you know, what do I actually got to do to get this thing? Uh, so sold my Black Edinburgh that I was given by Wargaming for uh, testing purposes, decided to open some crates. Um, I did open the bundles of three because they are the better value and, you know, what the hell, why not? Um, I'm not going to narrate all the way through vi the video. I'm, I'm going to uh, give you a, a cheater's version and tell you what ended up happening. If you want to watch till the end of the video to see for yourself, you be my guest. Um, I did re-record the voiceover because the voiceover that I did or the commentary that I did while I was recording it, um, afterwards I realized that my math was wrong and my numbers were way off. So, well, they weren't way off. Actually, as, as <laughs> I made mistakes, it counted out others' mistakes and my numbers weren't actually that far off, but I do, uh, do like to try to be accurate when I can. Um, so give you guys the uh, too long didn't watch version. Uh, I did five attempts to get the boat. Uh, first attempt, I had to open 30 crates before I finally got it. Uh, second attempt was seven, much better. Ha you know, a lot happier with that result. Uh, but then RNG Jesus said, aha, just kidding. Next attempt was 71 crates before it finally popped up. Now you do get three awards per crate, but I still had to open 71 crates on the third attempt before I finally got the boat. The next attempt was almost as bad at 62 crates before I finally got the boat. The last attempt was, 50, uh, I'm sorry, 21 crates before the boat popped up, um, which averaged out over those five attempts to be 38.2 crates in order to get the boat, which is way more gold than I personally would be willing to spend on my personal account with my money in order to get a boat that is in Edinburgh that is painted black. Um, yeah, that's just, that, that's a lot, that's a lot of gold. So um, I have had some good luck in the past with these crates and their drop rates. Um, RNG Jesus was not with me today. This was simply my experience. And, you know, I, I pray that anybody out there who wants this boat bad enough that, um, that you have better luck than I did because it was it was pretty frustrating, pretty demoralizing. Just keep opening crates and opening crates and wondering was I ever going to get the boat again. Um, so it, obviously it is a small sample size. It was only five attempts, but I feel like the numbers are, are uh, painting a clear enough picture for at least for my own personal decision. So uh, not trying to discourage or encourage anybody one way or the other. It is your money. You are free to spend it as you will. Uh, definitely no judgment from me for those of you who do try to get it. Um, I just, the point of this video was to share my personal thoughts because that's what I seem to do on these uh, and to take advantage of the opportunity that I had with the uh, gold provided by Wargaming to show you guys what the drop rate really looked like. So uh, now, obviously, you do get stuff every tr every try, and so you know the money's not totally wasted. If you spend the gold, you you are going to comp get compensated with something. Um, you know, it may not be the boat, but you're not just throwing money away. You are getting something for it of of varying values. But, anyways, that's that. 
Uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.